Hello and welcome to King of the Hill Season 1 Episode 1. I'm actually quite excited to get into this show because it's a show that I've known about for years, but I've just never really, like, watched anything about it. Like, I'm, I'm going to be real, I know nothing about this show, so I'm actually quite excited because, I don't know, it's a show that I've been wanting to watch for a fair while, but I never really had the opportunity to until, like, I don't know, around this time last year, they put it on Disney Plus in Australia, so I was like, fuck it, I'm going to watch it. And then, you know, this came second on the poll that I did a couple, like a couple of weeks ago, so I decided, screw it, let's go. But yeah, I mean, I don't even know what to predict for this episode, it's just called Pilot. Which, I mean, you know, it's pretty obvious that it's going to introduce the characters and that. I do know a couple of the characters, I'm pretty sure Hank is the main character, and then Bobby's the kid. I think there's a character called Peggy, I could be completely wrong. I don't know who she is, like, if she's the wife or just someone else, but pretty sure the show came out, like, either before the first season of The Simpsons or around the same time. I could be completely wrong, but I do know that it came out in, like, either late 80s, early 90s. Actually, I want to look that up. Oh, okay, never mind. This show came out late 90s. I thought it was around, like, early 90s. Anyway, let's just get into this. Okay. I just didn't really like the art on this show, though. And look, I don't know how to describe it, but it's just, I, I don't know, I just like it. Some of it also almost looks like it was drawn with pencil. Like, at least the backgrounds. Okay. Yep. <laughs> that sure is a fucking yep. motor. Yep. <laughs> mm -hmm. I, forgot, I fucking forgot about Hank Hill's voice. You know what it could be. That damn starter motor. You getting good compression? Yeah. Apparently, I gotta be real, I have no idea what they're on about. But I'll tell you what my truck really needs. Which is? Leadership. Oh, Detroit okay. Detroit hasn't felt any real pride since George Bush went to Japan and vomited on their auto executives. <laughs> what? Who's ready? <laughs> Y'all catch a Seinfeld show last night? Fucking Seinfeld. Is that what, is that what they're on about Seinfeld? I do not like that show. Taking his own bourbon, Kramer comes sliding in. Just, you know, we do I tell you what, man. Them dang old New York boys. <laughs> like, I'm going to be real. I'm going to be real. That guy, I, I don't understand half the shit he's saying. What you listening to, son? Oh, yeah. That's, that is the son. Is well, his name not? Bobby? I like this. I'm pretty sure it is. Of music. Um... <laughs> what the Mother fuck? Of God, it's all toilet sounds. Where did you record this? I bought it at the mall. Okay, for a second I thought there was meant to be music. I was gonna say that's very bizarre music. Nah, don't you worry, son. You just do your best. Don't listen to her, Bobby. Oh, okay. If you want to win, you're gonna have to do better than your best. I, I mean, I, I guess he's technically not wrong there, but like, if you fucking, if you, you know, try your best to you lose, it's not the end of the world. But what if the Wildcats give 110% too? Well, then you got to try even harder. How okay. How about Bobby gave 112%? Uh, sure, that'd work. Or maybe 113. <sighs> yeah, yeah, that's even better. Yeah, yeah sure. I, I, I don't know. 13 is a very unlucky number. Why? <laughs> Since when? I mean, I don't think it matters that much. Just as long as... I guess I'm pretty sure he just means as long as you pay, play better. Well, what's the difference? Look, I mean, Bobby, just do your best, okay? Yes. Oh, it's baseball, okay. Baseball is a fucking bizarre sport. Now you hit the next one out of the park. And somehow I feel like he's not going to. Run! <laughs> run! Run! Okay. Look at... <laughs> Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't even mean to fucking hit... The ball. Hey, don't look at me. Keep your eye on the ball. Keep my eye on the <laughs> I got to like, hey, cause you fucking me, just Watch distracting him at this point. Here you, Dad. Oh my oh. god, jeez. Yeah, well. Don't <laughs> find it. He got a black eye from his own fucking teammate, basically. That's what I want. A damned hammer. Now, where in the hell would I go? Hey, that's that Hank Hill fella that lives on the block next to us. He sure has a temper, doesn't he? Sure does. Makes you wonder who gave his boy that black eye. Oh my god. Jeez. Uh, you're gonna have to pay for that, dude. Oh my you're god. Fired. <laughs> Alice says she saw Hank. <laughs> Wait, is it really good if you think that he fucking beats his child? 
Did you hear about Hank Hill? He like, the fact that this is just going around everywhere and it's probably going to get, like, less true the more people it spreads to. You say he hit his son with a bat? Okay. That, that is definitely not acceptable. I wish I could, ma'am, but the regulations say we can't take custody of the boy without an interview. Yes. Don't you worry. He's in the system now. I am on my Oh, my God, okay. What the fuck? Uh, huh? Okay. Don't know what the hell that was. Hey, I know what's wrong with your truck. It's your quote unquote pollution controls. Wait, Fire what? on talk radio, you don't even need them. They're okay. just big hit government plot. How is cutting down on pollution a government plot? <laughs> the fact though, but this is the thing though, there's still people that like act like this today. You have been watching way too much TV, son. <gasps> come on, come on, Bobby up. No more TV. Turn it off now. <laughs> what the fuck is he watching? <laughs> oh. oh god, I love that poor man. Oh my god! Okay, well... There. That's better. I, I mean, I guess the fucking sounds... Is, oh my god. Oh, and they're gonna think that... Fuck me. And this is just getting even more fucked. ...to worker with the state. Would, would you mind if I talk to you for a minute? Well, sure. Come on in. Damn it. There it is again. Where is that thumping? Wait, I just realized he thinks it's from the fucking car. So, your assertion, Mr. Hill, is that Bobby got the black eye at his baseball game? Yes. That's not my assertion. That's what happened. Have you ever Could he ask, like, Hill? other people at no. the baseball game? And they'll be like, yes, that's how it happened. What the heck are you writing? All you gotta write is one word. No. Mr. Hill, I feel that you're coming from an anger mindset. I mean, yes. you're projecting this anger onto me... It gives me grave concerns as to how you facilitate your son's growth in private. Okay. Mister, I have not begun to project my anger onto you. <laughs> okay, I didn't feel like threatening him's gonna fucking help. I'm a substitute Spanish teacher. Los estudiantes son mis amigos. Okay. And you just have the one son? Uh-huh. Yeah, well, we would have liked to have more kids, but Hank has a narrow urethra. Peggy. In fact, Hank's sperm count. That's enough. <laughs> what in the yeah, but was that even like relevant for? at all? He asked me. He asked you how many kids we had. Yeah, not like. Ask you about my glands. Please, Mr. Hill. Loud is not allowed. Okay. What the? Loud is not allowed. Now you listen to me, Mister. I is that a gay boy that fucking Bobby has? Not writing down gobbledygook. I provide the people of this community with propane and propane accessories. Okay. Oh, when I think of all my hard-earned tax dollars going to pay a bunch of little twig boy bureaucrats... <laughs> okay. Like I don't think saying shit like that is helping your case. In fact, it's probably going to make you hate you. Hank's got a lot of problems. Hey, baby! How about a couple of beers? Sorry, should Gotta go. I got another migraine treatment with John Redcorn. Nancy, you've been going to that healer for 12 years and you still get headaches every night. Yeah. Healing process takes time, honey. Sure. If you say so. Getting back to the Hill family, have you ever seen Hank hit his child, Bobby? Hank? No, sir. Bobby's his pride and joy because of his narrow urethra. <laughs> I love how everyone's fucking mentioning this. You can ask my son. He's Bobby's best friend. Wait, oh. Joseph! Shit. What is it, Daddy? You ever seen Hank hit Bobby? No, I -uh, never. See, now you can just move along now. I've been calling y'all people better than a month now. Grab back y'all every time a dang old dog crossed these start yapping at y'all twenty four hours a day. And it, no, but I I could never understand what this fucking guy is is on about. Man, some weirdo came over and was asking us a bunch of questions. Yeah, he asked me if your dad ever whooped you. He hasn't, right? Of course not. You know my dad. He's all bark. Boy, that guy got him mad, though. My dad was like, Get out of my house, my <laughs> Okay, that impression's boy, actually pretty decent. I, I just realized that kid looks like the fucking... That guy that, you know, his mum or whatever was going with. For new ones. When I get my hands on Oh my god, is he gonna think this is actually Hank? I'll bust your butt into little pieces. Oh, I knew it. Jesus Christ. Good God, Peggy, this was on my road. Okay, her, na her name is Peggy, okay. Bobby? Bobby, are you alright? Come on out. I thought I told you to get lost. Come on, Bobby. I can put you with a nice foster family in North Oh my God, okay. He's just straight up just going for it. And they've got a pool. Honey, let's give him Luann. 
Hey, <laughs> oh I'm my god. Here. Come on. Right really? Now. Don't you want to live in a house with a pool? No. See, twig boy? Now get your skinny butt off of my property. Bobby, I know you can't talk in front of him. I said oh. get. Get. Get out of here. <laughs> Is this entire episode just going to be him trying to fucking convince everyone, you know, that Bob act Not Bob. Fucking Hank is actually, you know, beating. Yeah, I mean, the whole neighborhood was Redneck City. Did, did you see in the report how he dented my geo? Hmm. Redneck City. That's pretty funny. Where are you from, son? Los Angeles. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, let's see here. Hit by baseball. <laughs> so, uh, how did you like old Harvey? Who's Harvey? <laughs> oh, he's a little league coach. You did talk to the little league coach, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, no, he fucking did. This is what I was saying. Why isn't he, like... Talk to other people that were there involved. You talked to the little league coach, didn't you? <laughs> like, he definitely fucking didn't. What the hell is he doing? Son, have you lost your mind? Wait, Dad. You're not supposed to yell at me anymore. <laughs> the guy from the state said your hostility invalidates our parent-child contract. Sure. I feel like he's just fucking, you know, trying to fucking get away with shit now at this point. Hey! Uh, hey! Please, uh, respect my fence's right to be a fence. <laughs> now! Is this just gonna be the entire time? What the fuck is he doing? Who's... Okay, I, 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 at this point, I would be fucking furious. Like, I mean, obviously, don't fucking beat the child, but, like, still, I'd be pissed. What on God's green earth? Yeah, what the hell was that sound for? There's sound effects. Like that guy in Police Academy. That's what I'm going to do when I grow up. I decided. Okay. And I can't say boo about it. Bobby, a man from the Child Protection. <laughs> oh, wait, that's the guy, of course. Oh. He said that he told you last week that this investigation was off. Oh. Yeah, so you've been lying the entire week. And I have to. He's been worried. But I like him better this way. How come? What? I can make him love me even when I screw up. Oh, but well, that's Is depressing. That think? <sighs> it's hard, Peggy. I don't want to lose my little boy, my only son. But oh, it's hard. Well, yeah, especially when he's been a prick. Uh, you, uh, you're my son. Uh, yes, you are. Well, you know, with everything uh, that entails. Uh, uh huh. Uh, uh, you know, uh, feelings of uh, fondness. And yes. Just say, or, uh, <laughs> say you fucking love him. Uh, you know Is it really that hard? Boy? No. Ah. Uh, well, uh. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> what? Yes. It, it's getting so awkward. You're not making this easy on me, boy. <sighs> okay. I love you no matter what you do. There. Phew. Let's go get something to eat. Oh, uh, hell yes. I'm not. Just a big disappointment to you. Disappointment? No, you make me proud. I've been disappointed by just- Honestly, this is actually quite sweet, that. I don't know why I didn't expect something like wholesome like this in the show. Boy. Hell yes. <laughs> you know better than that. <laughs> he punched him. I knew it. <laughs> oh my god. This guy just needs to give up at this point. Honestly, I really enjoyed that. I mean, I had to pause it like five times. But yeah, I mean- it's a, it's a pretty good introduction to the show. Like, it was Hank, Bobby, and Peggy. Which, I mean, Peggy's such a weird name. I've never heard of that. But. I mean, I don't really know what to say, but that fucking child protective service guy was a bit fucking strange. He was so insistent on, like, busting Hank, like, you know, being a, you know, an abusive, like, parent. To the point where he heard an impression of Hank and just automatically assumed that that was him. But that fucking black eye, that would hurt me. Hit in the face by baseball. Like, I've never played baseball. I mean, it's obviously not really a big thing in Australia, but... But in PE, a couple of times at school, we did a baseball... Actually, it wasn't even baseball. We did a softball unit, which... Like, what the fuck is even the difference between baseball and softball? It seems like pretty much the exact same thing. I could be wrong, though. So, uh, that girl that's, like, their niece or whatever, I'm guessing she's going to be in the rest of the show because, I don't know, her fucking 
Bob is in jail and I don't know where the dad is. I don't know. Overall, that was a good good episode. I'm, I'm actually really enjoying this. I wasn't sure what the show was going to be like, but it, it's really good. I enjoyed it. I can't believe this only came out in 97. I thought this was a lot, like, at least a decade older. Does that mean it only ended in, like, 2010 then? Because there's 13 seasons of it. And I'm pretty sure they're bringing it back. Also, that fucking guy with the blonde hair, I forgot, I don't know what his name is. I could not understand a single word he was saying, like, majority of the time, but... I mean, I don't know what else to say. Overall, I've enjoyed that. Hope you enjoyed. See you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>